breaking dust and Hoffman just accused of disgusting sex abuse after new victim speaks out. Over the past several months, we've seen numerous Hollywood power players and A-list celebrities fall from grace, as they've become embroiled in the chaos of numerous sexual assault accusations. Unfortunately however, another has fallen from his pedestal, after one of his victims just decided to speak out. According to Catherine Rossetter, who is now age 66, Dustin Hoffman repeatedly groped her between scenes, squeezed her breast, and made her feel extremely uncomfortable. Even when she tried everything to get him to stop, he would not give up. Hoffman has since denied those claims. Daily Mail reports, a woman who acted in a Broadway play opposite Dustin Hoffman spoke out on Friday to say he groped her on stage nightly and refused to stop even when she tearfully pleaded with him to leave her alone. Catherine Rossetter played Hoffman's mistress in the 1984 Broadway revival of Arthur Miller's Death of a Salesman and subsequent TV movie. In addition to violating her on a daily basis, she says Hoffman also squeezed her breasts any time they took pictures together. The 66-year-old actress says being serially assaulted by her hero was horrific and demoralizing and something she still deals with today. She is the third woman in the past month to come forward and accuse Hoffman, 80, of sexual harassment. Rossetter told her story in her own words in an essay for The Hollywood Reporter. Published on Friday, she says she first met Hoffman in 1983, during an audition to play his mistress in Death of a Salesman. She recalls her audition for the role fondly, saying Hoffman immediately fell in love with her laugh and became her champion, even when the director thought she was too young and thin to play the role. The day before her callbacks, she says he got his makeup artist to make her look older for the role. When they did another read-through the next day, she says he even got into an argument with the director in front of her, saying the role had to go to her. Hoffman won the argument, but her happy memories of Hoffman ended soon after that. As soon as they started rehearsals, Rossetter says Hoffman crossed a line and started sexually harassing her relentlessly. She says the first time he got inappropriate was three days into rehearsals when he asked her to stop by his hotel room after the two had lunch together. When we stepped into the room, he jumped on the bed and said, Give me a back rub. He pulled off his shirt. I didn't know what to do. I said we had to be back at rehearsal in 15 minutes. He said, Just a quickie. I was a nervous wreck, but sat on the bed and gave a very lame rub. The maid walked in and I almost fainted. He laughed. As we prepared to leave, he looked at me and said, now we have our hotel room. 